Welcome to Grayon Math. We are asked to solve this problem. We have a square and a right triangle that overlap with each other. We are required to find the area of the triangle. Okay, so this since we have a square which has a side of 6, then it is bisected into 2. So this the side is bisected into 2, so this becomes 3 units. and Therefore, this ratio of this right triangle is for the longer leg is 2 and the shorter leg is 1. So, this will be the same for this right triangle since this is from a square. And if we draw a line from this point of the square to the left and from this point of the triangle downwards and from this point of the intersection of this square and the right triangle we actually form two right triangles this triangle and this triangle also okay so since this smaller right triangle is actually similar to this larger right triangle because they have the same inclination say this is a then this should be also angle a and from that we can label this leg as 2a this is 2a and this should be a because the ratio is actually 2 is to 1 for the legs, the longer to the shorter leg ratio. Okay, so next is we draw a line from this point upwards. And from this point of the triangle to the right. And we actually form another right triangle and this length is actually since the side of the square is 6 then this should be 6 plus a and if you divide that then this length is actually has a ratio also of 2 is to 1 so this becomes 3 plus a over 2 Okay, so next is we compare these two sides, this length to this length. They are actually equal in length. So we have 3 plus a over 2 is equal to 2a. And we can simply multiply the whole equation by 2 to eliminate the 1 half. So we have 6 plus a over 2 times 2 equals a is equal to 4a. So we have 4a minus a is equal to 3a is equal to 6. So 3a being equal to 6. If we divide both sides by 3, then we have a is equal to 2. Okay, so if a is equal to 2, then this becomes 4. This 2a is equal to 2a. 2 times 2 is equal to 4. Then 6 plus a becomes 8. 6 plus 2. Then this 3 plus a over 2 since a is 2 divided by 2. This becomes 1 plus 3. We have 4. And this a is equal to 2. Okay, so for the area, the final step is equal to, we can actually subdivide this right triangle into two parts, this part and this part. So for the upper part, the area is one half times the base, which is six times the height, 
which is 4. And for the lower part, we have it's equal to 1 half. So plus 1 half times the base, which is 6, and the height, which is 6. So we have area is equal to 6 divided by 2 is equal to 3 times 4, 12. And 6 divided by 2 is 3. So we have 18. So area is equal to 12 plus 18 becomes 30 square units. And that is our answer. So thank you for watching until the end of the video. Please like the video if you like our solution. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so you will be updated for more math videos like this. Thank you. Bye.